Okay, guys, we should be live. Um, oops, I've got two audios, so let's just double check that. Okay. All right, everyone, so it's Joe Giffords here from the Killer Content Academy. And um, yeah, this screencast today is a super brief one on how to get really smart again with Trello, because I'm all about Trello this week. It's Trello week on my site and in my community. And I wanna show you how I currently have a list on my Joe's Planner and Trello board, which brings in, um, you can see here, this is a content ideas inbox right here, okay? And the content ideas inbox is currently pulling in for me from Twitter, anything that has the hashtag content marketing, right? So I wanna show you guys how to do that because now I can go ahead in here and I can really easily see what everyone's saying about content marketing. It might be stuff that I can share to my audience. It might be stuff that I can respond to. It might be stuff that I can put my own spin on. So I'm gonna show you how to do that just here. And I use this recipe, so I'm in ifthisthenthat.com, I-F-T-T-T.com. And this is the recipe that I use, and I'm going to show you how I set it up, walk you through it really quickly, so that you can have your own um, Trello lists, which are archiving and collating and curating your research, um, we, you know, while you get on with your day, because then you can have all your stuff coming into an inbox. So currently, the recipe I'm using is, I'm using uh, Twitter as the if, as the if trigger, so if there's a new tweet, from search hashtag content marketing. Then in Trello, it will create a card on my planner board and I've already specified which list it's going to go on. So if there's a new tweet from the search and content marketing, and obviously for your industry, you could have whatever you want here that's a, a particular hashtag that you're following. And I have specified just down here which board it's going on on Trello what the name of the list is and whereabouts I want that uh, new input and new card to be positioned. So currently, every time someone tweets something with the hashtag content marketing, you can see it, um, I can see it on my Trello board. Now just think about the possibilities of that, guys. Straight away, if you are following a, a sort of Twitter chats or a certain keyword related to a conference, an event, that you wanna make sure you know who everyone is who's talking about it, you can set a trigger hashtag right here and help it to have, and then allow it to have a new card on your Trello board. So you never have to leave your planner, it's all here. So I see all these ones now coming in live. Um, and then I can click on each card and I'll be able to see the link and who tweeted it and what it's about and where I can go and it's just bringing all that stuff in for me now I can have several lists set up so that I can track certain keywords and and certain hashtags and it will all just populate my Trello board so that I'm allowing my research to come in now if you guys watched my video from earlier on in the week I was also talking about um, how to use a similar setup to automate your client answers to surveys. So for example, on Wufu, on Google Forms, on Typeform, and to also pop that straight into your Trello board as well. So you can bring in all your smart research straight away into Trello and you can go ahead and sort it out. So let's pretend we're gonna do a new recipe. So my recipes. And I'm going to create a new one and just walk you through the steps really quickly so you can do this one yourself. So create a recipe. I'm going to do a search for a different hashtag now. So if this, I'm going to choose Twitter as my trigger channel. And I've already got an account here on If This Then That and it's set up my channels already. And I'm going to say, uh, new tweet from search is the trigger and I'm gonna search for killer content to see who's talking about killer content and this is my output if you like this is my 
outcome that I'm desiring. So I'm going to choose Trello as the action. I'm going to ask it to create a card. Uh, I'm going to put it on my Joe's Planner board. Okay, great. Um, if you don't already have a list to set up, it will create one for you. So I'm going to put this one as killer content, hashtag research. And I want every new card to come in at the top of the list. So every time something's mentioned, it's going to come on the top of the list. And then I'm creating an action. So currently, if there's ever a tweet with the hashtag killer content, um, there'll be a card created in my planner. Um, and every new card will go to the top of the board. And then I just go and click create recipe which is what it's doing just there and now if I go over onto my board and refresh tell me I've been disconnected from the server so let's do that come on it looks like my streaming's down just a little bit okay so when that reloads on my board there will be the new list bringing in all of this information. So I would love for you to explore that. If you found it helpful, let me know. Let's go check if any of you are watching and want to uh, add to the Facebook Live. Um, ba -ba -ba okay. We have some comments. Okay, so Amy, yep, um, you're watching. That's awesome. I'd love to know what you think if you use the hack. Um, and yeah, so I'll be doing some more of these in the week. If you want to join my group, it's Brilliant Ignition and Power Moves. There's more stuff going on in there as well. And also I have a new blog dropping tomorrow with a content upgrade with loads of goodies for you on all the tech and things to help your killer content plan workflow be super smart for you. So that's it for now. I'm going to leave this mini broadcast and I'll be back soon with more.